back to Andrew's Old School Garage. And today, I'm going to be doing another video on my Ford 120. But I just wanted to show you guys something first. Uh, yesterday, on Sunday, I picked this little puppy up. It's um, a 3-inch bench grinder. So we got an 80-grit grinding wheel and a buffing wheel. And I had just bought this for buffing and stuff. And I thought I'd just show you guys it. And I am not going to turn it on. I don't feel like climbing all the way up there to plug it in in that orange plug. But I'll show you guys what I did last night while buffing. Also, I brought I bleh, I bought this br I can't speak right now. Brown polishing compound from Harbor Freight. Also, I got this from Harbor Freight as you know, Chicago Electric. Yeah, but it pretty much just comes in the stick and then you just rub it against the wheel as it's spinning and then you go to town with buffing. So, I did this yesterday. Looks pretty nice. I did these two bolts. It's really easy. It's just, um, you're going to want to make sure that this is close against the wheel because, um, it was, I had a little far back and the bolt got stuck in between the wheel. So, yeah, that's that. Uh, polished, tried to polish this for my Broadmoor. Uh, so, yeah, I thought I'd just show you guys my, um, mini bench grinder. I'm very happy with it. It's got a uh, 36 RPMs. As you can see right there, 36 RPMs. Yeah, it's a uh, very quiet. It's a nice little grinder. I like it. I'm happy with it. But anyways, guys, uh, I'll see you guys when I get outside. Um, see ya. Alrighty, guys. So, as you just uh, saw, show you guys my tiny grinder. But this will be video part two and there's an airplane flying over right now so hold on you guys see the airplane yeah anyways back to the tractor so what i have done today yeah got our spark tester hanging down it is very cold out guys so Anyways, what I did today is I took the points cover off, cleaned up the points because yesterday after I made the video, it was not getting spark because we and my dad were trying to, you know, start it. So, we cleaned the points, we tried to turn it over and stuff, and it, oh, it does turn over. I'll show you guys. Hopefully I didn't get any of this stuff mixed up, but... just saw it turning over so turns over so it didn't get spark even if even after we cleaned the points hiding down there so from the motor that we have sitting right there um this is off of a toro tractor not a wheel horse not a wheel horse not one of those a actual toro itself tractor it was a toro 12 garden tractor but um my dad and i and me scrapped it because it was just bad but there's the hood for it right there so yeah if you guys need a um hood or a grill comment down below uh, maybe we can get in touch and we can sort something out, but yeah Anyways, so got the coil off of this motor and and I'm happy about the coil because It's a Mopar and now uh, I'm a car guy, so I like my Mopars. All right, so I got that Mopar coil on there So I'm it's my favorite part about the tractor right now one of my favorites, but yeah, cuz I like Mopars anyways Oh my god, it's a bird Sorry, those two birds just came out of nowhere. Um, where was I? Ah, yes, coils. Place the coil. So, I uh, showed you guys it turned over. So now what I will go and do is I am going to um, go and clean spark plug wire up and then clean, come on camera, focus. Why is this not focusing? 
The camera is not focusing, guys. I'm sorry. Come on! Focus! Oh, camera problems. Anyways, you see all the rust on there. So, I'll go clean this up and, um, yeah. See you guys when I'm done. Okay, guys. So, update. My dad is back. And, um, now this is the coil off of the big wheel horse. It's new. And it's brand new. And we've cleaned the points. This is the spark plug wire also off the wheel horse. And, um, there's still no spark. <laughs> So, I'm lost, and my dad is too. The only thing we could think of, it's right over there, Mom. There's something wrong in the wiring harness here. I mean, I know that that is cut, so yeah, I'm starting to think that that might have a problem with it. No, it doesn't. Yeah. Okay, because we can check the wiring harness off the wire cord. But, um, yeah, so that's where we're at. And the guy said that it ran last year, but if it's literally not getting any spark and we've cleaned the points and we did, did this, I don't understand how it ran last year. It should be getting. should be getting spark. Unless that, unless this is bad. The wire? Yeah. That's the one off the wheel horse. Oh, this is too? Yeah. Oh. I think. No. No. Where's the one off the horse? Oh. oh, this is it. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's the one off the wheel horse, guys. And you put it in between here. Yeah. And then grounded it. Yeah. I even used that spark plug right there. Yeah. Hmm. Where's the condenser at? I mean, right there. Oh, that's got to be grounded. Like that? Yeah. Oh. Guys, we might have figured out the problem. That's that's supposed to be grounded, Andrew. You gotta put that... Where's the clamp? There. Now it's grounded. Alright. Let's try this again. Hopefully you guys won't fall. Oh. Alright, stay. Uh, put it... That? Yeah, that's fine. Alright. Let's try this again. <laughs> Hopefully you guys will see if it gets spark. Nope. nope. We're still not getting spark, guys. Well, this is a problem. Guys, if you know what could be wrong here, Please leave a, leave a comment down below and help us out. <sighs> problems, problems, problems. Yeah. Unless, well, unless this is bad. Even though he said he replaced no, it. No, this is just, this got nothing to do with it. This is free. This is your starting relay. That doesn't, it's not where your spark comes from. I mean, there's that one down there. Well, we had to replace that on my uh, mini wheel horse and then it no, got spark. we have to follow the wires yeah. from your ignition switch. Yes. You know, this stuff, a lot of it's corroded. Yep. Alright guys, but, well, that'll wrap up part two for today. 
and the camera's not focusing. Why is the camera not focusing? There we go. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Subscribe, help me get to 50 subscribers. Leave a like, or hit the like button if you'd like. Leave a comment down below, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!